all hell is going to break loose. He's begging for money now, saying he's flat broke. Uh, he looks rather depressed, and he actually put this out to his people. Shame on anyone who gave him a dime. Watch this. Hey, everybody. This is Randy, the mobile traveler. I, uh, I'm going to give you a little update on what I've been doing and how the motor's coming along. It's not great. Right now, I can't find a motor. The one I found isn't going to work. And motors are expensive. They're all way too much money for me to afford right now. This, this is all like scam salesman talk. This is all like to butter you up. I mean, he's really like taking his time and saying the right things to like get you where you need to be to feel bad for him. Because at the end, I'm going to spoil it. He drops the bombshell. I need money. I'm begging. He begs at the end. He begs. Maybe in time I'll be able to find a motor. I keep looking outside because people are moving around out there. Hopefully I'll be able to find a motor here pretty quick. One that's affordable and one that actually works. So, I guess there's a lesson to be learned here. And that lesson is, don't buy an old rig. Or if you do, make sure that it is definitely mechanically sound. Ace, you need to go. Um, you know, some days I, 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 for the most part, I'm pretty optimistic. And for the most part, I'm pretty calm. Like right now, I, I may look calm on the outside, but I'm like that duck in the lake. Just calm as heck up above the water and down below, I'm swimming like hell. Old feet are just paddling like crazy. So, I, I kind of flabbergasted. All right. So, knowing that, watching him set this up in this way is so ultra sickening. To be, uh, fully physically able to get out there and make your own money to have all of these people sitting there you know you could sell anything to these people and he's going to sit there and just ask for donations i mean this is so fucking sick he's really building up how hard he's been working so throughout this whole thing he's going to be building up oh i have been working it's like fucking boring you know what i mean like I don't think people accounted how boring these guys actually are and how repetitive they are and how they kind of have one story that they're retelling over and over and over again. It's a slow burn and you watch this man lie. You watch him deceive. You watch him fall apart and beg. You don't need to know anything about this man or care about him. I just think it's fun. Let's find out. Let's find out. You know, people... I don't, I don't like being in this predicament that I'm in. I don't, I'm actually pretty scared right now. I, uh, you know, every now and then people need help. I try to help people as much as I can, whenever I can, morning, morning, however I can, be it feeding them, working on their rigs, getting them back on the road again, or every now and then I'll throw them some money when I have it. Go, go Ace, you need to go lay down buddy. Well this time. I need help. If you guys find value in my videos, value in me, 
And you can see it in your hearts to help me. Help me. If you can't afford it, that's fine. No ill feelings here. I know that times are tough right now. Trust me, I know. Everything going on. Uh, I don't like this to save my soul. I hate it. But I got to do it. I don't want to be that guy. I want to be out there doing things on my own, you know. People say if you can't afford this lifestyle, you need to leave it. Well, this lifestyle is actually pretty inexpensive compared to paying hundreds of dollars for rent somewhere. And if I was doing that, I couldn't be out here helping people. Anyway, I am going to list my PayPal down below. If y'all want to you donate suck. to the channel, get me back up and running. People don't get the same kick out of donating to the same guy over and over and over again for doing nothing. Right up. So this is like a lie. Now he's trying to do so. What you got to pay attention to is he's trying to pump up his content. So he's throughout this. He's going to start telling little fibbers about how all the stuff that he does is really amazing. Kind of trying to get you to plug it so you do have something to give your money to. We have times. Uh, it's so unfair to the people too who are tricked by this. You know, think about all the followers. This is a con man. This is an arrestable offense in my opinion. I would like to cuff him. Does Sheriff Pat Melton know about this guy? Imagine Sheriff Pat Melton taking him back into that Pulp Fiction room and putting the ball gag in his mouth and giving him an old time. That's it. Shut the fuck up. Oh, man. Wow. What a nice one, huh? Another one bites the dust. We're watching him fly.